Hello and welcome to another episode of Dad vs. Daughter. I'm Tim the Dad. I'm Megan the Daughter. And today we are playing Legendary. Now this is a cooperative or semi-cooperative game because while we're going to be, for the most part, playing together as a team to defeat the bad guy, um, at the end we're going to tally up points to find out who was the most legendary. Now, first thing I'm going to do is I want to show you the layout of the board here. It's really pretty nice. You have... Uh, five spots here that represent the city. This is where the bad guys are going to come out that we have to fight. They're going to come out through the sewers because they're bad guys. Move over to the bank, the rooftops, the streets, and the bridge. And if they get pushed off through the bridge, then they are going to escape. Now, the great thing about the way the board is laid out is it basically tells you where everything is going to go. So let's meet today's villain. We are playing against... Loki. My favorite. Loki from the <laughs> Thor movies, if, you, uh, if you've watched those. Loki is our mastermind, and he has four master tactics, just like all of the, um, uh, the masterminds in this game. And he is going to go over here in the mastermind slot. As we continue to set up the board, you'll notice we have an area here for shield officers. So this is represented by Maria Hill. She is going to provide us two recruit points, and she's going to cost three recruit points in order to get her in our deck because this is a deck building game. So what we're going to be doing is we are going to be building up our deck as the game goes on. Now, uh, Megan, let's talk about today's heroes. Who are, who are we going to use in order to take down the bad guys? Okay, so first hero I'm going to point out is Natasha Romanoff, the Black Widow. And she is a covert. Covert, covert yeah. Covert, mainly. Yes. Covert and tech. Yeah, so see the different symbols, covert and tech. So that will be her ability. She's one of my favorites. And then we have Bruce Banner, the Hulk. He is a strength. Strength. Strength, strength, strength yeah. and some instinct. Instinct. There's two different symbols there. So that will be his. And then Tony Stark. My favorite. Iron Man. So he's a tech and range as well so that's helpful because each symbol kind of goes with each other and then emma frost who's not an avenger she's an x-men but she's still cool um she is the um covert and instinct, instinct as well and then we have the brother thor so he is a range and what else is he something else strength strength yep the green back in the back so that is our heroes now in the rule book it is going to go over and talk a little bit about what each of the hero classes are that we were just talking about. The, the strength, the instinct, the covert, the tech, and the ranged, as well as the different team affiliations that they have. X-Men, Avengers, S.H.I.E.L.D. Uh, and then when we get into the later expansions, there are going to be uh, more teams like Marvel Knights and X-Force. Spidey Friends. Spidey Friends, that sort of thing. Yeah. So... You know, a mastermind needs a bunch of henchmen. Mm -hmm. And in this setup, we are going as a two-player game, we are going to have two villain groups and one henchman group. That These are going to make up our villain deck. And there's going to be a couple other cards here we're going to talk about in a minute. So we're going to introduce you because, uh, because Loki always leads the enemies of Asgard. So those are going to be the ones that are... Uh, based off of the mastermind. So those are gonna be part of the villain deck. And then our other villain group is gonna be Hydra. And if you watch the Captain America movies, then you should know, or the Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., mm -hmm. you should know who Hydra is. And then our uh, one henchman group is gonna be the Savage Land Mutates. Basically, basically these are the, um, the low-end scum bad guys. Mm -hmm. They're pretty easy to beat. Now, other things that we're going to add into the villain deck, we're going to add, because of the this is a two-player game, we're going to add two bystanders. So we'll put those over there. We are going to add five Master Strike cards. And when these come up, these are basically going to represent the mastermind taking a shot at the heroes. Mm -hmm. And then we have... Scheme Twists. Scheme Twists. Which follow in, along. In this, in this uh, scenario... We are going to put seven scheme twists in the villain deck. So when these come up, basically this represents something that's going to happen in the story of the game. And this is, uh, we're using seven because the scheme that we're going to be playing today is... 
portals to the dark dimension. So you set up with seven twists, and they are each dark portal. So when they come up in the city, you have a dark portal. Um, for the first twist that comes up, you put the dark portal above their mastermind, and he gets plus one attack. For any two through six that come up, you put them in the leftmost city space, and that gets one plus attack to whoever villains there. And then if the seventh one comes up, evil wins, which we do not want to happen. Right. And now a couple other things on the board that we're going to point out is the wounds. Now, certain cards will make you take a wound if you don't have something to, to basically stop that. What those are going to do, those are going to go into our discard pile when we collect wounds. And then when we shuffle our deck, they're going to get in our hand. And basically, it's going to be a useless card. Some cards, like the Hulk, actually take advantage of that. And they're able to get rid of those or KO them out of our hand. And it, that will also add power for that hero. Uh, but for the most part, they're there to clog the deck. And then we also have a stack of bystanders that um, we're going to be able to rescue. And those are going to be worth points at the end. So what we're going to do is we are going to uh, shuffle up all of our heroes, and those will represent our hero deck. And then we're going to flip five, and we'll always have five down here in our HQ. Those are going to be uh, heroes that we're going to be able to recruit into our deck and then be able to play them against the bad guys. We're also going to shuffle up the villain deck. And on our turn, to start the turn for each player, we're going to flip one up and put it in the rightmost spot in the city. Now... We will also start with a hand of basic cards. Megan? Okay, so these are your shield agents and your shield troopers. And they each have one recruit and one fight to help you out to start with until you start picking up the heroes. And then what you're going to want to try to do is basically get these out of your deck because they're not as powerful as the heroes that we are going to uh, want to draw and use their special powers. Now, when we play, we're going to have six cards in our hands unless... Uh, there are cards that will allow us to have more. Let's get the cards shuffled up and we'll get ready to play. All right, so as you can see, we've got the cards uh, laid out here. This was our opening HQ. We've got... Uh, Emma Frost, we've got the Hulk, we've got Thor, and a couple other Emma Frost there. So, Megan, why don't you go ahead and start us off? Okay, so I have my six cards, and first we have to flip over a villain. Yep. So that is a Savage Land Mutate. So, he is going to cost three uh, fight. fight in order to defeat him, and then he doesn't have an ambush effect. Some cards do, and when they come out, you have to take care of that. When you fight them, they, some of them have a fight effect. So mm -hmm. we'll explain that as we play along. Yep. So I do have three fights, so I can take out him. And his fight thing, ability not thing, is when you draw a new hand of cards at the end of this turn, draw an extra card. So I'll have seven. So that's nice. So that's taken care of. And then I have three recruit. So I'm going to take this Emma down here. Yeah, that's three. your only option. Whoop. So whenever you buy it or you recruit a, a hero to your deck, then you flip over a new one. Yep. and. All right, so Your it's turn. my turn now. Flip over a new villain. Yep, so we got another... I did shuffle those. I do want you to yeah. know. <laughs> another Savage Land Mutate. So I actually have four recruits and only two fights, so I'm not okay. going to be able to fight him. Uh, for four recruit, I can either get the Hulk or I can get Thor. Or Emma. You can take ever, anyone but this one. No, that's this true. Five. Let's see. And these Thors are the same. Yeah. This is if I have... Let's see. If, I, if you made... Eight or more recruit this turn, you get plus three fight. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. uh, I really like the Hulk, though. Because you may KO a wound from your hand or discard pile. If you do, you get plus two. We'll so that's around. really good. So I'm yeah. going to take that. That will be my turn. Okay. And move over. And I'll drop six new cards. Okay. So I have one fight, which isn't going to do me any good against this. And I have six recruit. So I think... What's this Black Widow do? She KOs a card from your hand or discard. If you do not, you rescue a bystander. Um, That'd be good to get rid of wounds. Yeah, I think I'll take that for three. And then I have three more, so I'll take that in. A, and that will be my turn. And with the base set, which is what we're playing today, mm -hmm. uh, there are 15 heroes that come with this. Um, and for the most part, I let Megan pick these out. And yeah. Megan always seems like she picks Emma Frost and I like Black Emma. Widow. They're my favorites, and Black Widow still needs a movie. 
Yeah, if Marvel's watching, she'll I'm probably pushing get for it. it. Okay, <laughs> so I've got four recruits and two fights, so I still cannot fight anybody. Uh, I could go for the Thors, or I could go for the, uh, the Emma Frost. Nice. Play the top card of the villain deck. Yeah, I'm not really big on that. And I do know that with uh, Loki, there's some things that come up that um, we need range. So I'm going to go with Thor there for, okay. for my four. And I'll shuffle my uh, this card up and then draw six yep. new cards. Okay, and now we have a Frost Giant who came into the mix there. Um, so I'm going to play that Emma first. I could draw, allows me to draw a card. So I have three, four, five recruit and one fight. So fights aren't going to do me good. So yeah, she's going to give you a recruit yeah, too. So, so you got six, six recruit. Okay. Um, I'm going to take this Iron Man for three, and I really don't want a Maria, so I'm going to fizzle that other recruit. And then, All right. Scheme Twist. Okay, so... Opens up the first Dark Portal. That is going to go over here under Loki. And Loki is now going to be... 11. 11 to fight him. Yep. So it's not looking really good. Uh, I did get a Thor. So that's going to give me that's good. extra recruits. There you go. And that's going to go along with the four that I already have. All right. So that's going to give me six total and there one fight, go. which is not going to give me a bit of good. Um, uh, you know what, I'm going to go back and get another Thor, okay. and I'm going to not do anything with the rest, so I right. only have two, I can't buy anything. And another Scheme Twist came up, so that will go right over here, above the bridge, if I can pick the card up. There oh, we go. That's I know. Good. That's not good at all. So, an Emma allows me to draw a card, and I have another Emma, so I can draw another card. And then, I have... Two more, so I have six recruit, and one of those, and this. So I do not have another covert card, so I cannot use that ability. But that's three fight. So I think, let's see. I think I'm gonna do the mutant before he gets into the bridge, just so we're safe there, and that allows me to draw another card when I draw up. Yep. And so I have six recruit. Uh, what does Emma do? She's five. Each player can reveal another X-Men hero, and any player who does can draw a card. I think I'll take her for five, and then fizzle that other one. And she is the only X-Men character that we're playing, so... If you have another Emma. It's kind of limited there. We can do it, and then... Oh, twist. No. That's, that's not good. Did you really shuffle those really Three well? already. Yeah, I did. <laughs> okay, well... This could be a quick game. Here, let's go ahead. I've got three recruits. Okay. And that is not going to do me a you bit of good. You take a Maria. I could... But do you want to clog up your deck? Well, it's not really clogging my deck. It would give me two recruit. If you want to, I mean. So, you know, I think I think early on I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay. So there's my three recruit, and now I have uh, two fight there plus the Hulk. Unfortunately, I don't have any wounds to KO, so mm -hmm. I've, I've got four. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take out the Frost Giant here. Okay. I think. So what's his fight? His fight is each player reveals a ranged hero or gains a wound. I so, do not have and a I didn't have a ranged hero, mm -mm. so we're both going to gain wounds that are going to go on our deck. Yeah. But with Hulk, I'll be able to use this later to my yeah, advantage. Yeah, that'll be good for you. So and that's going to be uh, if you, there's a little red dot there. So he's worth two victory points at the end. Yep. So is that it for you? That's it. Okay. Master Strike. I don't know if okay. you're good with this. <laughs> so the Master Strike basically represents the uh, the Mastermind coming down and taking a whack at us. Yep. So. Uh, Megan, go ahead and read Loki's Master Loki's Strike. Loki's Master Strike is each player who can reveal a fight icon, which is the green fist. The strength. Yes, strength. That, that, that's what I meant. Or you gain a wound. I do not have one in my hand. So do you have Hulk or well, Thor with that ability? Hang, hang on a second. I gotta <laughs> shuffle my cards up here. I don't, so I'm just gonna go ahead and take that wound. So I kind okay. of So I need a fight need, yes. or a strength. A green fist. No, I do not. So, so I gain happy a wound. birthday. Okay, so now I'm going to play. I get to draw a card. And I have three fights and four recruits. So I'm going to take out this one. So his fight is you can gain a shield officer. So I will take a Maria for free. Oops, Oops. just one. <laughs> and then I have four recruit. Oh, what's a store deal? If you made eight or more recruit in this turn. 
I don't think I can do that yet. So I think I'm going to take another Black Widow. And that will be my turn. And right. new card. That's not bad. He's easy. Okay, well, He's easy to here's where Thor, uh, Hulk is going to come into play. Yeah. Because I'm going to be able to use his ability because I do have a wound in my hand. Yeah. So I'm going to be able to KO that. And that's going to give me plus two fights. So the Hulk has four by himself. There you go. There's five. And uh, that's it. Yep. So five I also fight? have so five fight and four recruit. So you can take out either of those. Yeah, you know what? I think I will take out uh, the this Savage Land Mutate so I can draw up an extra card yep. at the end of my turn there. Smart. And with four uh, recruit, let's see. You know what? I've been taking Thors, so I'm going to grab another Thor. Okay. Is that it? Yeah. Okay. So refresh that, and let's see. I have a wound, so that's going to go into my discard, so I'm not going to play with that. But no, you know what? Never mind. I have a Black Widow, so let's use her ability. I don't have another card right. Never mind. Those go in my discard. That's the problem. You get your hopes up, and then you can't do anything. Now, if you don't buy or fight, then you can actually get rid of the wounds that are in your hand. Yeah, but I'm going to fight, though, because I have three fights, so I'm going to take out this guy so I can drop another card. Which reminds me, I, I should have drawn my seventh card. Okay, and then I have three recruit. So I think I want to take this Iron Man. So that will be my turn, and Hydra comes up for you. Okay. Well, unfortunately, I only have two fights. Uh, I've got a lot of recruit, though, because I've got a Maria Hill. So mm -hmm. there's two, four, six recruit. There you go. Ah, here's a Strength Thor, and I would get plus two recruit, so he would be worth four recruit. I kind of like that, so I'm going to take him for three, mm -hmm. and then let's flip another one here. Okay. Ooh, the the big uh, Black Widow there. Yep. So I still have three recruit. I guess I'll take this Black Widow. Okay. And that'll be my turn. All right. So flip over, get another Hydra. And so I'm going to be able to draw a card. And I'm going to play this Emma. Do you have another X-Men hero card to reveal? I don't think I've hand? even bought an uh, I thought you might have. I don't think I did. Well, I have another one for me, so I can draw a card, and then I can draw another card for that, Emma. So I was going to draw two cards. Are you sure? When you deal up now? Uh, survey says no. Nope. Okay. So, and then I will put down that. So that will be five fights. And one, three, four, five, six, seven recruit. So for my four, five fight, I'm going to take out this one, I think. Do I? That'll generate two more Hydra. Yeah, I don't think I want to do that. I think I'll take this one then for three. And then I have seven recruits. So what does this Black Widow do? You can defeat a villain or a mastermind that has a bystander. She's four or five, though. I think, uh, do I want to do that or do I want to? Yeah, I'm going to take her. And then that will be my turn. Okay. And then Frost Giant comes up for you. All right. Well, I don't have any other covert, so... There's Black Widow for two and uh, Shield Trooper, so that's going to give me three fights. And then I didn't have enough extra recruit, so Thor's extra fight ability is not going to come in. So okay. that's going to be two, four, six recruits. So three fight, six recruit. Um, three so fight. three fight, yeah, I'm going to take out this Hydra guy. Good and it. it says I may gain a Shield Officer. So not bad. I'll get that. And with uh, my six recruit, wow. This Iron Man looks pretty good He's there. Five. Um, What's his ability? You know what? But I've got a lot of ranged yeah. Thors, so, so I'm going to take this one instead. Okay. And that's going to cost me three, and that's a... I've got three left. Oh, you can buy the other Iron Man. Yeah, I can get the other Iron Man, so that'll be good. Okay. Right. So that is your turn. Scheme Twist. So he's now worth five over here on the rooftops. Well, that's not too good. So I'm going to play Emma, and I can draw a card. And I got a wound, so I'll just put that in my discard. And then I have that. And this. And two there. So I have one fight. That's not really helpful. What, what's her ability there? You get plus one for each bystander in your victory card. I don't have any. All right. So, so one, one fight's fight. not going to do anything. No, again. but I have five three, recruit. Four, five recruit. Um, what's this Iron Man do? You get plus one for each other tech hero. You fight this turn. I don't know if I want to take that one. I'll take this one for three, and then that will be it for me. Okay. And, excuse me, 
Uh oh. I think good. Well, yeah, we're, we're getting close there. We're not doing really good at all. Uh, actually, we're doing really bad. Yeah. Because I only have mm. two fights. That's not helpful. And I don't have another strength hero, so I'm not going to be able to use Thor's bonus ability. Mm. That's going to give me five recruit. Yeah. I could go after that Iron Man, um, which is going to be three. Yeah, I think I'm going to. Yeah. Let's see, what does this Emma do? She's worth three. Each player. You know what? I'm going to go for her because I can take advantage of that when you play your other one. Okay. So that'll be you. my turn. Master Strike. All right, so Loki oh, is going to. Do we have a green fist in your hand? Well, let's find out. I one, do two, not. Two, three, I will take a one. Five, six. Do you? I do not. Mm, happy birthday. Okay, so do you have an Emma in your hand? Not yet, because I, I just bought the first okay, one. Okay, so that's not going to do good because I don't have another one. Um, And then seven, eight, nine. Fight, so I'm too shy away from hitting Loki. That's not too good. Um, well, you can clean the city up a little bit. I think I might. He's so. five and four, so that's nine. Is that what you said you had? Yeah. You might as well take them both out. Yep, so this one, two more. No, let's do this one first, so that way I don't generate, push them down. So do you have a ranged hero? I do, for Iron Man. Yes, I do. I okay, have four. so we do not get a wound. That's good. And then I'll take him out, and we have to reveal two new villains. So one, two. Well, they're easy. That's a good fight. And I have three recruit, and I'm not going to buy anything. So there's my turn. And you bring up a Viper Hydra. Okay. Is that your new villain? No ambush effects yet. Okay. Well, here's a good thing. Because I have Hulk, and I have a wound in my discard pile yep. that I just got, Hulk is going to have four fights. Oh, and the next uh, guy there is going to give me five. You could take out the Viper then. She's five. Yeah, and what's her fight ability? Each player without another Hydra villain in their victory pile gains a wound. I do have Hydra. I have Hydra as oh, well, so we're good. I will go ahead and I'll take, take that out. Yep. So then I have two, five recruit. You know what? I'm going to go for the other Hulk because yeah. I'm going to let you go for the Iron Man's there. Okay. That'll help with the wounds, and that's my turn. Okay, another Hydra comes up. And draw a card because of Iron Man. Draw another card because of Emma, so that's helpful. Um, <laughs> I have a Black Widow, but I can't use her ability, and so that will give me two, three, four, five fights, and three recruits. So if I fight, I'm going to take out, take out that guy, so I'll get to draw another card up, and three recruit. I'm going to take out it. Natasha. So that will be my turn, and Frost Giant comes up for you. Okay, unfortunately I'm not doing very good because I have a, a wound, so it's not, and I don't have a Hulk. Hulk, so I've got two fights and four recruits. So I think with the four recruits, I'm going to go ahead and Emma, I will take, Emma, no, I think I'm going to take uh, the Black Widow there. Okay. Well, no, because that's that's the bystander one. I don't have any bystanders. Let's see, the, bystanders play the top card of the villain deck if I do, but it's, that's worth two fights, so I'm going to do that just so I can get the fight. Okay. So that is my turn. Rare Emma. So bystander came up, so that goes under. So the, when guy. a bystander comes out of the villain they're deck, captured. they're captured by the villain that is closest to the villain yeah. deck. And it moves along with them as they progress through the city. So my cards here. Draw another card. So I'll do that, and I got a wound. So that gives them a discard, and I have. That Natasha, so I can defeat a villain or mastermind that has that bystander for free. So I'll get rid of that oh, that's one. That's nice. I know that worked out conveniently with how I drew that. So five and then three recruits. So I'm gonna take out. I really don't want two more to come up, so I'm gonna take that one for three. And then I'll let you draw another card. Yep. At the end. So I have three recruit. I'm not gonna buy anything. Okay. So there's that for me. And you take for you. All right. That's not, that's not bad. That's good. Well, I don't have any other uh, covert cards, so I'll just play that Black Widow for two. Okay. Um, but I do have but. a Hulk, and I do have a wound in my discard there pile. You know. So okay, that's going to that be four, so get rid of that. Nice. I Six. will play um, this Thor for two recruit, and he has the ranged icon, so I can play the Iron Man. He's yeah. going to give me plus one fight. So seven. So I'm at four, five, six, seven. seven. There you go. I'm getting there. Well, did I do that right? Let's yeah. see. That's three, 
seven, eight, nine. Nine. Oh, two more. Do you have two more? Ten. No, you're one away from him. Though. So. You um, can clean up the city. Yeah, I'm going to clean up the city. So I'll take this guy out for three. And then. And that's going to be more five. Come up. So three. Ooh, that's, a, that's not so, bad. And I said I had ten, so nobody's worth two. No. So that's not going to help me. I have three, three recruits. You can't buy. Uh, yeah, there's nobody to buy. Shana Maria, but... No, I don't think so, because... Okay. You yeah. don't want to? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, that works. Alright, so Here that's going to be it. I'll be able to draw an extra card up. Okay, this guy moves over. Ooh, that's not good for this guy to move over. He's seven. So, we really need to hit Loki. I know we do. So, there's an Emma. She allows me to draw a card. And I have that, and that's range as well. So I get plus one fight. That's helpful. And, oh, I have that Iron Man. It allows me to draw another card, and it's a wound. That's not helpful at all. And then I have that fight. And Oops. So that. you're at three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, and then three recruit. So I'm going to take out, which one? Yeah, you can take out the Supreme What's Hydra. One? Supreme Hydra is worth plus three for each other Hydra in your victory pile. You've got a lot of Hydra. I'm taking that guy. So he's gone. That's my fight. And three recruits. Not going to allow me to buy anything yet. Okay. There we go. Well, that's helpful. All right, so let's yep. move it along. And they have an ambush effect. Yeah, okay. His ambush is each player must reveal a range hero or gain a wound. And I need to draw it. The, oh, I do have a range there hero. So there's my range hero. Three, four, five, six. Please. I do. I have an Emma. All Yay. Right. Okay. So be, since I know you have an Emma, okay. I'm going to play uh, my Emma that says each player can reveal an X Man hero. Each player who does gets to draw two, a card. So. so you get to draw a card. Nice. Um, and then, I, unfortunately, I don't have any more wounds. No. How often do you say that? Yeah. Unfortunately. Uh, that's so, a good thing, though. So my Hulk is not going to get any bonus there. But that's still five fight right there. That's uh, good. I don't have any extra range guys, so I'm not going to get Iron Man's ability. Seven. So I'm only at seven, and that's all the fight I have. Now, okay. the recruit, um, and because that's the Thor that's the instinct one, yeah. I'm not going to get Thor's bonus. So two, four, six... Seven recruits and yeah, seven fights. Okay, so you can go after you know this what? one or this one, and this one allows you to draw three cards right now and play. Oh, well, then so let's you do that. that one out. So you get three new cards to play. So, all right, so one, two, three. And they are? Uh, one extra fight, which is not going to do me a bit of good because nope. I've used everything. But I'm going to get two more recruits. There you go. So what I said, I had two, four, six, eight, nine. Ooh, there you go. Well, you buy some stuff. Yeah. What's that Emma do on the end? She's the, seven. Yeah, she's the powerful Emma. It says whenever... You defeat a villain or mastermind this turn, you get plus three uh, recruit. Plus, she's five fights, oh, so I think her. I will take her Definitely. for seven. And that leaves me with three left. You can take the Iron Man. Didn't I say I had ten? Two, yeah. four, six, eight. No, no I only oh, have nine, so. so two. So that's it. That's that's good, though. you got to get Emma. Scheme twist. Uh-oh. We're Wait, one away from losing. That's not good at all. we got to hit Loki. That's looking hard to do. Okay, so Black Widow allows me to draw a card. And do you have another X Men hero in your hand once you uh, shuffle up? That allows me to draw a card. Right there. Here in a play that. Because if you do, you can draw another card. So uh, I do have yes, I do. I have Emma. Draw a card. I drew a wound. That's not helpful. So then I have my fight. Okay, I can get this one. So this is plus one fight for each bystander. I do have a bystander because I rescued that one. So that's fourth fight there. So five. I'll take out this guy for four. So that will draw me, allow me to draw another card. And then th one, three, four, five, six recruit. Um, I want to say, yeah, that's a good Iron Man. He's yeah, worth three I'll plus five. Him for five and fizzle. So that will be my turn. And Master Strike. Oops. So we don't move that guy. I do not have a green fist at all in my hand. I know that much. So I'll get a wound. Do you? I do not. But that's okay because I'm going to be able to use that to my advantage. I don't have any. I can't ever draw any of those. So here's where that comes into play. There's my Hulk who allows me to Ew. get rid of that for an extra that's two good. fight. And so I don't have four. any other covert cards. So four, so six fight. And I can't even hit him because he's a seven now. And you can't hit Loki either because you no. love it. So actually all my fight just kind of went to waste there. Yeah. So two, four, six recruit. You can take anything down there. <clears throat> yeah. I, I want to leave the Iron Man for you. 
You know what? I'm going to take this ammo for four, mm -hmm. and I don't believe there is a two. Flip that hero card there, Megan. Um, yeah, sorry. There you go. So, oh, I should be able to buy it. Yeah. So, unfortunately, all that fight and nothing to hit. That's a and swing and a miss. We're going to get another wound because well, I don't have a green fish. I'm not too concerned with that. I, I am. <laughs> I can't draw any. It looks like I buy him, but. Okay. So, out of my cards, I have two wounds. I do not. So, I will take a wound That's to put sucks. in my discard. Okay, so I am going to play that Natasha, who allows me to get plus one for each bystander in my victory pile. So I have one there, and five, and I cannot use her ability because no one has a bystander. So that's five, and then six, seven, and her ability. And you've, you get her mm -hmm. bonus because you've played yeah, the covert. Yeah, so you may KO a card from your hand or discard, and if you do, you rescue a bystander. I'm going to KO a wound. Yep, so there I've you got go. a bunch of those. And so rescue, rescue a bystander, bystander, so that's going to go in your victory pile. So that would give me two then? No. But just not... No, because once time. you've played the card, you don't get the bonuses after okay. it's... That's what I thought. I want to make sure. So that's um, four. No, that's three, seven. Seven. I can defeat him. We'll get him out of the way. Do you have a ranged hero in your hand? Yes, now? I do. I do not. So I'm getting the wound, but that's okay. He's got some pointage. And then I have two, three, four. Aha! I can get him. That will give me a green fisty, which is what I need. All right. So that is my do not be a scheme twist. It's a bystander, but no one's there, so that's okay. Okay, so now since no one is in the city and a bystander come up, that means the bystander is going to be captured by Loki. So we're going to put that over here. Well, that helps me with my Natasha card. Okay, so let's go and let's see what I got here. Um, unfortunately, I've got two, four recruits. And oh, I've, not, you stuff. I've not played any other coverts, so I've got four fight. So four fight, there's nothing to hit. No. Four recruit. Um, you can get anything but the Thor there. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and Take grab this Emma. Emma. Yeah, and that's okay. it. Okay. And got that guy. That's, that's okay. So Natasha allows me to draw a card. And then I get to draw another card. Plus Iron Man's card. ability because you played a tech. Yep. So then I have this Iron Man with the tech ability. So you get plus one for each other tech that you have played this turn. So, so that's gonna be three, worth... four, five. Yep. That's good. This Emma allows me to draw another card. So let's start with the fight. I have, so how much fight did I say? Five, six, seven, eight? That yep. what I said? Yep. Eight, so that takes him out. Okay, I did have this one, which goes with the tech. I can rescue a bystander. So I'll take no, I can't you, do that yet. No, because this I was the that. first card you played. Okay. So you have, have you would have had it. to have played a tech before that. Okay. Well, well that's okay because time. you you were able to use mm -hmm. him uh, yeah. based on what she had. So. so I can't fight anymore, and I have four recruit. I'm going to take uh, I'm gonna take this Thor. Let's do that. And that will be my turn. And we're doing good. We're not pulling up schemes yeah, at the moment. Yeah, but the problem is the, the villain the deck is very thin, and when the villain deck empties, we lose. And we still haven't even hit Loki we once. We have six cards left in the villain deck. Okay, so let's look at see what kind of recruit I have. Two, four. I have two, four, five, six, seven recruits, and because I played a ranged card, I'm going to yeah. get plus one, so three, so four. So I'm going to be able to hit this guy, yeah. and I'll drop an extra card at the end. And two, four, six, seven, recruit. Um, you can take anything down there. Yeah. Do you want to take? Two you know what? Now I'm going to take the ranged Iron Man, and I'll take that Emma. So that'll be six. Fizzle. Yep. So. Okay. That will be my turn. Hydra came up. Okay. Do you have? Well, we don't normally play this poorly. Uh, normally yeah. we. Loki gets yeah. caught. Do you have an Emma in your hand once you draw up? I do. So because I do. people watching this are going to say, boy, you guys suck. Yes, we I don't. Do. Okay, so you draw a card. And so that Emma allows me to draw a card. And this Iron Man allows me to draw a card, which was a wound. That's not helpful. And then I have that one. So I have another range. Yep. So that gets me three Here's there. Plus one. So you're at six fight. Seven. And then four recruits. So I'm going to take out this one. The two more are going to pop up. Come up. Ooh, okay, we're good. Oh, but he's got an ambush effect. Do you ever? I do have arranged. So yes, I do. I have the. Iron we're good. Man. So that takes care of that. And for recruits, I'm going to take an Iron Man. Okay. Oh. Uh, did you? 
Yes. Scheme twist. So we lose. Evil wins. That's not good because I was about ready to lay the hurt on Loki. Seriously? Seriously. Did you because, have hit him? Yeah, I could have hit oh. him. Because there was there was four, That's nine, so upsetting. Uh, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, you could have hit him. Yeah. Oh, uh, gosh. 15. That is just the luck of the draw. Wow. It's really crappy. Luck. This kicked our butt. We've played this a couple times. We uh, and, well, the last time we played this, we didn't we win? No, we lost. We lost? We lost. But we didn't lose this bad. I think we hit Loki two or three times. But uh, I don't think we did, but okay. Loki's, I know we hit him a couple times. We hit him twice, maybe, but, but uh, Loki's too good. Yeah. You know, I don't like giving trophies to the bad guy. But it's Loki. And why do you like Loki? Because he's cute. Now, Tom remember, Hiddleston's cute. Okay, the Loki of the movies, <laughs> that's what you're referring to. All right. But he's cool, so points for Loki. Okay, so that is Marvel yeah. Legendary. Uh, stay tuned because what we're going to do is we are going to go through each expansion. So we're, you're going to see the cards from each expansion, the masterminds that were in those expansions, yep. and um, that way you'll have a, a good idea mm -hmm. of how things go. So this was just the base. The next one will be Dark City. And Dark City is a large expansion, yes. so there's going to be more to see. So hopefully we, will... we win that time. <laughs> yeah, really. Yes. Yeah, so, All right. Yeah. So we will see you guys next time. Bye. Like and follow us on Facebook to stay current on our show schedule, sneak peeks at future shows, and to interact with us.